Good evening. Um, for our prayer time, we're going to use the scripture from Matthew 9, 27 through 31. As Jesus went from there, two blind men followed him, crying loudly, Have mercy on us, son of David. When he entered the house, the blind men came to him, and Jesus said to them, Do you believe that I'm able to do this? They said to him, Yes, Lord. Then he touched their eyes and said, According to your faith, let it be done to you. And their eyes were opened. Then Jesus sternly ordered them, See that no one knows of this. But they went away and spread the news about him throughout that district. Let us pray. I invite you to breathe in deeply. And release all your tension. Shake out all your worries. I invite you to breathe in and let those words settle into you. Do you believe that I'm able to do this? Do you believe that I'm able to do this? Do you believe that I'm able to do this? They cried out. They always cry out, have mercy on us. They want their life different, their world to be different. They want to live in a world where they can see, where mercy isn't something you have to scream for, where seeking compassion isn't something you have to beg for, where kindness is not something you have to demand. Do you believe I am able to do this? What would you say to Jesus if he asked you that question? Would you have doubts? Would you worry about the ramifications? Would you be silent? Would you nod your head slowly, tentatively? Do you believe I'm able to do this? I wonder how we answer this question, what we are seeking. A cure from an illness or sight, insight. Being able to see fully, completely, beyond the fog, through the haze, to experience and perceive the truth discern what is real. Do you believe I'm able to do this? Lord, help us to see the flooding in India and Bangladesh and China and Vietnam and Pakistan and Indonesia and Egypt and Myanmar, Afghanistan, Nigeria, Brazil, Thailand, the Democratic Republic of Congo, Iraq and Cambodia. Lord, help us to see. Lord, help us to see over the 1,700 healthcare workers who've died of COVID-19. Lord, help us to see Beirut, Lebanon, after an explosion injuring at least 50,000 people and leaving at least 137 dead. Lord, help us to see habitats lost approximately 5,760 acres per day extinction of 30,000 species per year. Lord, help us to see friends and family who are nearing the end of their life. We grieve from them and their families. Lord, help us to see there are celebrations occurring weddings, but they are different. Help everyone to stay safe and well. Lord, have mercy on us. Allow us to see with your eyes and to bring your mercy to our world. Amen.